what's up youtube it is your fan football fan 2233 here bring you episode number 10 of my losses to bosses and right now as you can see we go into this uh, division 4 online season uh, we just a quick little look at our lineup. We only have three rare players, and I mean three rare players. So uh, that's not a uh, very good. Uh, but anyways, um, we will uh, try and see if we can pick up some better players. In this first match here, we get matched up against a team called Sweatsville FC with a Spanish solid uh, team. Uh, anyways, but it is me getting the game started here, Makango. Breakthrough uh, after a nice through ball from Shafro, a fake shot, and he is in on the goal, and the, he smashes it into the back of the net to make it one 0 Then this says Fabregas making it one one, smashing it into the back of the net, and then it is ah oh, David Villa really getting a very very bad rebound, uh, which I didn't think was deserved, but um. They got another rebound here, David Villa, another rebound, uh, my goalkeeper, I thought, I think he, he makes way too many rebounds, he gives away way too many rebounds, there's a lot of rebounds that he shouldn't be giving away when he just slaps it out to their opponent and then they can put it into the back of the net, so uh, I'm kind of disappointed uh, with that, but uh, anyways, he is normally a very good goalkeeper and uh, he saves a lot. But uh, here I made a penalty and Jordi Alba would uh, convert it. Uh, but then it was me here um, getting the goal to 4 2, will take after 80 minutes. And then here again, it is Misilu finding McKengos, putting it into the back of the net in the 86th minute. But then shortly after, it is Robert Soldado who will score uh, in the 88th minute and uh, make it 5 3. So um, unfortunately, we'll lose. Um, kind of disappointed with that um but uh, nobody really likes a uh, losing uh, do they uh, i don't think so um sometimes fifa is kind of a harsh game you feel like wow wow right now i have momentum i can put a bit of a pressure on him and then suddenly he will just go up and he will score two very very easy goals and and that's sometimes just what happens and he will go into another division four match um against uh, bionic fc and uh, this guy's team didn't have the perfect chemistry he had some good players here and there like uh, torres uh, el shirawi and Menes, um, Raphael, Montalivo, um, all some good players, but they didn't link up on the pitch, and that's why um, I think so. Uh, I get the lead here, uh, one nil after eight minutes with Makengo, and then uh, that it is Makengo here again, um, dribbling a bit inside uh, the box here, uh, and then takes the shot and puts it into the back of the net. Nothing really to do for the goalie there. That was a very good shot, and then it is a for Tomasi here, uh, taking a run down the wing, um, using his 85 pace uh, and a couple of fake shots to get inside the box here, throws around, shoots, and I don't know how that was a penalty. I mean, referee, how could that be a penalty for me? I don't understand. I really don't understand. Um, anyways, it was a penalty for me, and show fro will step up for that and he will indeed shift to Makango who then can step up, shoot it in the green, put it into the top of the net to make it 3-0 and then it is Misilu here fake shotting Raphael and then um, the ball falls to Wildek with a nice little skill move, another fake shot around two players and he puts it into the back of the net and then my opponent passes the game and we all know what that means a rage quit i win 4-0 uh, after 31 minutes on a rage quit and uh, by me winning 4-0 also meant means that i have to go out and i have to pick up a play player and um, i'm really looking forward to um, showing you which player that i uh, chose uh, when I uh, needed to go out and buy uh, the player 
Um, I can tell that it's the right forward that I wanted to buy this time uh, because I um I just felt like I needed a bit more pace in the in the attack and area because uh, sometimes I just feel like my uh, attackers they are really slow and lacking after um, the defenders uh, and the defenders can catch up with them even if they're in um in the in like a, a counter situation uh, some of my players then they can get catched up and that's just not the thing i want for my right and left forwards that they can get catched up um when they like have a free chance uh, I, that's not what i'm looking for but anyways we search for here for a right uh, forward and um we found a Taylor and more and Ainsworth and a bit of more Taylor and and Ismail and Vincent and Kiernan and uh, but none of them were appealing to me. So I found a uh, more here and uh, I buy him for three thousand coins and more. Um, welcome to the club. Uh, welcome to losses to bosses. I hope you like it here as uh, my. Good friend Kitchen Daniel would say, or the famous YouTuber Kitchen Daniel would say, uh, he would uh, kind of use that. Uh, welcome to the club. Welcome to Bell FC. Um, if you haven't already seen uh, Kitchen Daniel's um, like uh, Road to Glory, or starting from scratch, or a bit like this, uh, where he has a star player. His uh, star player is Slatan Ibrahimovic. Um, he has a, he's the only gold player he has in the beginning of the series and now uh, he's playing and buying contracts uh, until he has a full gold team and he has won Division 1. He is uh, doing Season 5 right now so uh, I'll, uh, many episodes you can tell um, he has made uh, through, um, through uh, his 5 uh, se seasons of it. Uh, I think a season is around uh, 35 to 40 episodes, so that's, that's almost, uh, oh, okay, maybe 30, but he has made over 100 episodes, and that is uh, really a nice thing. But anyways, uh, he got the lead here on the gameplay, and uh, Shofro making it 1-1, and Shofro, oh, Shofro, Shofro, a very nice uh, left forward indeed. Not uh, the best pace, but... He's just so so good and that is definitely a player that I don't want to get rid of just like quick and uh, fast because he is one of the better non-rare bronze that I've used. Shofro is very 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 good indeed and um, I don't know what it, what it is uh, that, that is about him. He's just very very good and I can't really understand how he can be so good for a non-rare bronze. Um, it's kind of unbelievable. I don't know um, what it is. Really don't know. Maybe it's just I don't know. He's just very, very good, and I really like. I really enjoy uh, using him. But anyways, here we go. Search for a center mid, and uh, we do indeed find a uh, Coke here. Coke. Um, a very good player we put him on a watch list and we buy him now so uh, coke welcome to the club hope you like it here and um mad xd gamer actually said in a in a in a bronze beast video that this was the best bronze center mid in the game so i'm really looking forward to see how he will perform and uh Turn by me buying coke and uh, storing a uh, barnet in the club it is the end of the episode if you like the video please leave a like and comment and maybe subscribe to my channel guys or subscribe to my channel guys it will mean a lot to me i will uh, talk to you later and yeah goodbye